Hey guys, sorry I'm late. Traffic was crazy. What'd I miss? Hey everybody. So the new Venom movie is coming out this weekend. I know everybody's been talking about it. Uh, I can't wait to see it myself. When I saw the second trailer, I saw a scene in it, the scene in the bodega where his face opens up and he goes, we are Venom. And I thought that would be a super sweet scene to recreate. So I need some flats to make it look like we're in a bodega. I need some other people to help me out. We need costumes for them. And then of course, we need a full Venom costume. So let's start there. Okay, so first things first when making a Venom costume is that you need a bodysuit. Uh, these are pretty cheap on the Amazon. It's a full bodysuit, goes over all your parts. I added the little veiny symbiote little parts in here with white hot glue. Hot glue comes in colors. So I sprayed all the white material with a little bit of gloss black just to take some of the edge off and make it look like it's uh, blending into the suit a little more. Here's the full body suit, and this is all well and good, but obviously Venom is jacked. Venom is super, super muscular, and though I've done a push-up or two, uh, I'm no Venom. So I went through all the different muscles that I saw in the trailer, which are, you know, general human muscles. Uh, I made pecs. I made all this out of foam that I shaved and carved and stuff, and then put on this cardboard shoulder pad that I made here. And then this goes around the suit, and with these giant shoulders, it should look like it's just all one piece. Originally, I wanted to put this inside the bodysuit and have it just be one big giant thing, uh, but when I tried it on, it didn't fit. So I had to, uh, you know, figure out a different way to do this. Um, sometimes when life hands you lemons, you just gotta be like, dude, I don't want lemons. I'm still not muscular enough to be Venom, so. Underneath the bodysuit, what does fit, I used two different knee pads that I strung together, and these are gonna be my biceps and my triceps. I put these on underneath the bodysuit, and it makes it look like I'm bigger than I actually am. This is a very, uh, very fun suit to just walk around in uh, when nobody else is home. Have you guys seen the gym? Don't worry about it, I'll find it. So here is the helmet, the head face, the facha. Uh, it's just made out of a old motorcycle helmet that I got at a thrift store. And then I elongated the frontal lobe and the chin and the jaws with some cardboard and some poster board. And then over that, I covered it with the same material as the bodysuit so that it all blends in and looks like it's one piece. The jaws of the mouth are actually bolted in on the side so that the mouth can say hi to you. The teeth are just made out of foam. They're not gonna hurt you. Uh, the gums are made out of putty that I put around the foam and then let it dry. The eyes are just poster board and they're around the eyes. I made little eyelids with uh, other pieces of the material that I just cut up. And then the coolest part of the whole thing is that he talks. A fishing line that goes through the side of his head into an eyelet in the bottom of his jaw and then gravity, which is pulling it down is thwarted, and you can make it talk. Do you want me to put you on? Yes, I do! So, the coolest part about this whole trailer, the whole shot that made me want to do it in the first place, was uh, when his face opens up and you see Tom Hardy's sexy face. I couldn't really do that with this helmet because it's, uh, you know, super cool and I didn't want to break it. So to make this breakaway helmet, I just made a cardboard structure, covered it with the same material as the, you know, head and body. I made the teeth the same way as I did on the other helmet, out of foam. Uh, I made the eyes basically the same way as well. But then when I was done, I cut out with my knife and it can open up like that. When you see it in the trailer, there's these teeth that are on the bottom of it, and so I added some extra teeth there. And uh, there's all this weird black veiny kind of stuff going on, and so uh, I found this Halloween decoration and took off all the little pumpkins, and I think it serves the same kind of purpose. So those are all the pieces of the puzzle. We have all the things we need. We have our bodega, we have our people, we have our Venom costume, we got me. Let's go make it happen.
Oh, uh, I got a parasite. Yeah. Good night, Mrs. Chen. Ooh. Uh, ooh. 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 Like that? Yeah. Maybe? Yeah, that's closer. Okay. <laughs>